Hello everyone, welcome. Today we're going to uh, start from the our first pattern lesson for Embot Neo Embot 2. First of all, you need to open uh, Mblock software and go to add a device cyber PI. You need to add only cyber PI device. You don't need to go extension and you don't need to install all the extension stuff because we're going to use the Python, not the blocks. Only blocks you need to install the extension. For Python, I'm going to show you how you uh, import all the modules like we're going to install the extension. It's very easy once you learn the basic um, the next lessons we're going to go for a uh, few advanced lessons okay let's jump okay so we're going to use for embot neo obstacle avoidance faith and coding series that's my name Shia Abdul and I put my youtube channel we need to do here is first we're going to import okay before that I'm going to use this will be case one um basic obstacle avoidance okay. now as you can see we need to import the modules so what we need to do is we're going to import we're going to import m build and import m bot 2 and we're going to import event and we're going to import time and last one is cyber pi so we import uh, mbuild import 2 event time and cyber pi 5 modules we import and next we're going to use at event start so what does this do is even start uh, so to run the functions when the program start and I'm going to use def on start so what does this do is when import new start this button is the button when you start when you click uh, start on position and um, this is the code so when the import neo turn on the following code will, will run so what we need to do is while um true so while true is it's a loop and the forever the loop start okay so this is um, if you see, think as a in the blocks it called forever and the loop start so we call in the Python's while true after that we're going to use if m build um, ultra Sonic two, ultrasonic, uh, ultrasonic two. Okay, get going to use one. I'm going to explain you in a bit. Twenty five. So, what does this code do here? Is um, is check if there is an obstacle within 25 centimeter using mbolt ultrasonic sensor okay m m bot to turn to use 90 degrees okay so in this code what this do is if there's an obstacle within this range then make ember two turns 90 degrees actually else else 
home m bot two forward thirty and if there's uh, if there are no obstacle within this range then make ember 2 go forward at speed 30. Next is we're going to use time uh, dot sleep. We're going to use 0 0.1. So it's a wait for 0 0.1 second before starting the next iteration of the loop so well true okay so wait for point one and again it's going to start so this is a loop this will keep going forever now let me upload to the embod neo so we have embod neo here let me turn it on <coughs> So I'm going to turn it. I'm going to turn this on because I already have a code on start, so that's why it's a uh, just start. I'm going to use my button is broken, so I don't have the button here. So you can see my button is broken. So I took out the button, so I don't have the joystick. So I'm going to use without the joystick, but it's cool. You can use this and what new. You don't need to have them joystick unless you you need to program this ember joystick for these lessons we don't need the joystick so i'm going to keep it here and i'm going to connect so if you can see you will see everything in here if you get any error when you upload the code you will prompt it here or in here you will see a red color something so i'm going to use upload choose the mod switch upload and click upload okay we don't have okay we see a error fail main line 16 i'm not sure you can see that okay it's a fail main line 16 so we need to find the 16 line okay we can see line 16 even you can see in here uh, the log line 16 so what happened here is let me check line 16 so this should goes to um, in here because if and after that it should cause to the uh, pillar in here so let me upload it again and see okay we have still have issue now is 17 so what you need to do here is 17 else should go to the if position okay i don't know if you can see this line it should be straight if else should be in the same position and i'm going to upload and we have 17 again so i'm going to use okay now line 18 so line 18 should go to here and the time should go here okay i'm going to do upload it again so line 19 so line 19 um Okay, can see. Let me 
show you what will happen now. I'm going to use my hand to circle avoidance. So it's 25 centimeters, so that's why I take. Uh, I'm going to change to 10. Let me plug it back. Let me plug it back. I'm going to change to 10. Um, 10. And I'm going to upload. Actually, I need to connect. I'm going to upload. Okay. Now check uh, 10 centimeter. Okay. So this is how you uh, do a pattern obstacle avoidance code. Thank you for watching and if you like coding videos for Peyton, please subscribe to my channel.